Whether it's academics, community service, or football, Stafford High senior Marcus Smith is always giving 100%. He has verbally committed to play football at SMU. A Stafford resident, Smith has a 3.4 GPA and is committed to success in the classroom. Um, last year, I, wrote, I started doing web tech. It was like writing code for websites and stuff. And just I really found a passion with it. I want to... I'm, I want to write code for games, like video games, and hopefully I'll make it in that. A kid that would notice the smallest thing that you needed or that you changed, and um, I know that he's going to be doing big things now, and I'm, I'm really proud to see the things that um, occur because it couldn't happen for a more deserving person. He is such a gentleman and has impressed me with his academic behavior. He cares about his grades. He comes and talks to me and touches base with me often. And it's very clear that he's very studious and diligent. And overall, I've been very impressed with his demeanor, his attitude, and his work ethic. Smith is an Eagle Scout. His Eagle Scout project was a garden at Fort Bend Family Promise, a nonprofit in Fort Bend County. He became a senior patrol leader, and as a senior patrol leader, that's when his job is leadership. And at, at some account, people take some of the younger scouts and then just talk with them and help them, you know, get from where they were as starter scouts, moving up to the position that he was as a senior patrol leader, and then eventually he could stop. Made two garden beds with, with, uh, with vegetables in it, so the people that, uh, the home that we uh, did the project for would have fresh vegetables in it. And he and I bounced across a bunch of ideas and one idea that I threw out that he just, he just grabbed on it. I could see the passion in his face. Uh, it was the idea that for our family guests here at Fort Bend Family Promise, families that are experiencing homelessness, we're helping to get back to sustainability, but they're all families with children, school age or younger. And I said, what would be better for these families? We have this big outdoor area, yet land with all kinds of play areas, but how about if we could have some, maybe some raised garden beds where they could actually grow some produce and see what it's like to get food that actually comes right off the vine. And Marcus just got so excited. He says, yes, I see where I could do it. I could do it. He's a selfless individual. That was my feeling. He really feels like he wants to give. He's very modest. Uh, but, but just has an incredible giving heart. Smith loves volunteering. Marcus Smith, he's my youngest son. I have three sons. I have an older daughter. And just watching Marcus grow from a boy into a young man has been such an enlightening experience for me. Uh, I have just witnessed my son turn into such an awesome young man. He uh, has such a caring heart. He always tries to help people. He's made Eagle Scout this past year, and his love for football has always been there. He started with Stafford Cobras when he was maybe about nine years old, and he has just always loved to play football. Good, very hardworking young man. I'm so proud of him. Moving forward in his future, he wants to play college ball, and for him to receive a full scholarship to SMU has just been awesome. School is first. I always tell them, school is your job. You don't have time for anything else. If you can't make the grades, then you won't be doing all the extracurriculum activities. So I make sure that he's doing what he needs to do in the classroom. I stay involved with him in school. Marcus's strong faith is very important to him as well. Uh, church is number one. I, I stay with God. Marcus was a very faithful young man. He was faithful in his attendance faithful in his participation in the church. I just like, when I was younger, I played flag because my mom didn't want me to play tackle tackle. And when I was finally able to play tackle, I just had time in my life. He became a student of the game after his freshman year, learning how to do, uh, I think he's played every position on the offensive line, which is very valuable going into most colleges. Uh, they want kids that are versatile. So he's played center, he's played guard, he's played tackle. Uh, we, he played quick guard, he played power tackle. So he's played all up and down the offensive line. Uh, he works real hard getting his footwork. He's got great feet for a kid his size. I got recruited by U of H, Rice, Yale, Tulsa, uh, 
Alcorn. I had 15 and all. Like, as an old lineman, we don't get as much credit, but it just we're the most essential part of the team. Because without us, the quarterback can get hurt. No plays can be made. Marcus is a great player, a uh, real student of the game. And I feel like he brings a lot to the table because of how much he knows about football, but also as a great teammate. He uh, encourages everybody, brings everybody up to play to the best of their ability. To be a captain, just to be a leader to all the teammates, to all my teammates, and just so that they can be inspired by me. So that they can know that they can go to the next level. SMU, wonderful ride scholarship. It's like all my hard work's paid off. Big camp.